Thanks for stopping by. Today we're talking about the differences between homologous structures and analogous structures. So this is a topic you may come across in biology or evolution. Let's talk about homologous structures first. So homologous structures have a similar structure, meaning their anatomy or the bone structure is similar. They have a differing function, so a wing versus an arm versus a fin, for example. And they form from a common ancestor, so they have a common ancestor that gave them that structure. Analogous structures, on the other hand, have a differing structure, so they do not have a similar anatomy. But they do share a function, it's a similar function, so wings, fins, things like that. And they do not form from a common ancestor. So let's look at some examples of homologous structures. So the arm of the monkey uh, and the fin of a norwal. Those would be homologous structures because they are a similar structure but have a differing function. Again, the wing of a bat and the leg of a mouse would be homologous structures. Uh, some analogous structures examples. You can look at a bird, the wing of a bird versus the wing of an insect. Definitely a similar function, but not the same structure and not from a common ancestor. Again, another example, the fin or wing of a penguin and the fin of a shark. They both use them to swim with, so a similar function, but a different structure. To remember homologous structures, think homo means same, and so they're from the same ancestor. And if you remember that, then you'll always know that the analogous structure is the other one. That's it. Um, if you have questions about vestigial structures, I'm going to make a video later, so I'll link that here once it's done. If you have any other questions about homologous or analogous structures, feel free to ask them, and please share this with your friends and subscribe. Thanks.